This playthrough is rated T for teen. Greetings and salutations, viewers of Alamar back here with another episode of Front Mission 3. In the last episode, we decided to take a quick detour as some civilians were in trouble and we helped Mori escape. However, the uh, the town he was trying to defend was blown up. What will he do now, now that, uh, well, I mean, I guess we'll keep going on. It's just sad the sacrifice that happened to the civilians. Well, I guess not really sacrifice, but they, they died, so that sucks. But uh, anyway, we're continuing on and... Uh, getting closer and closer to Lukov, but it's it's getting tough with all the forces he has, so let's continue on. Lukov, I never authorized a missile attack on Kaida base. The mission was taken to take over the base. We succeeded. Many men were killed. You call that a success? That the base was uncooperative. Now that it, now that it's destroyed, I'm sure the other bases will cooperate. I am I wrong? You that's enough, Major Croy. But... Lukov isn't entirely wrong. Other bases will cooperate after seeing what remains of Kaita Base. But if you ignore our orders again... I understand. You command the missions. I follow your orders. There it is, Major. Continue the mission. Dot dot dot. You you know you you clearly know that Lukov has a plan up his up his sleeve. He's just like, oh yes, you're in charge, sure. <laughs> How's Lieutenant Mori doing? He'll be fine. <laughs> I don't know. Depend on the original playthrough, he got blown up. So actually, even when I replayed the level, oh wait, uh, no, when I had to replay that level to get the platinum, he ended up. He was the only one who survived. <laughs> oh man, because those guys, other guys die like really quickly. All right. Um, Colonel Takamura is asking for you. Please follow me. Dot, dot, dot. Here it is. It's time for the reunion. This is your last chance to run away. <laughs> Shut up. I'm here to beat him down. Yeah, sure, sure you will. You guys are such babies. Says the lady who keeps whining about, like, being in uncomfortable places, fighting all this stuff, being in... Eh, whatever. Um... We'll be fine. You stay by the lieutenant's side. Thanks. Hmm. Yeah, it took a while for Miho to finally have some, like, major character <laughs> going. I mean, you know what I mean, character development or whatever, but... Colonel, they're here! Alyssa, um... I forgot what voice I gave him. It was so long ago. I think I just gave him, like, a deep voice, and that says, Alyssa, I'm glad to see you. I was worried. Dad, you're okay. That idiot did okay. Who are you calling an idiot? You're one to talk. You haven't grown up a bit. Shut up. <laughs> yes, that that's gonna prove you, you've, you've grown up, Kazuki. Stop it, Kazuki. We have no time for a family feud. Are you the CIU agent? Yes, sir, I'm Mayor Edward. I guess the OCU can't leave the crew situation alone, but the culprit behind the coup is Chief Assess Sasaki and Makurio headquarters. You'll be better off talking to him. We have no plans to contact the coup force or send uh, to send an OC military like Allardesh. You're asking us to take care of ourselves. Yes, the OCU right now, especially Southeast Asia, is hanging in the balance. If this balance is disturbed, the OCU will break up for sure. Japan must maintain its current situation for the OCU's stability. Which would weaken them in the eyes of the DHZ or the USN, so... The coup forces took the capital and are being joined by other divisions. It's only a matter of time before they change Japan. That's why I'm here. Mr. Takamura, you used to work as Sasaki's right-hand man. Sasaki knows your abilities well. That was a long time ago. Sasaki used your name in starting this coup because he didn't want you to, as an enemy. You pose a threat to him. But I can't do anything by myself. You're not alone. Look, this base is providing you with a hideout. There are other divisions that are in conflict with the coup forces. Are you suggesting that I start a civil war? You're the only one who can stop the coup. But then the entire country will become a battlefield. I understand what you're saying. 
but the coup relies on force. Casualties will spread if you leave them alone. Mm. What, what's the saying? Uh, uh, evil winds of good men do nothing. But you're wasting your time, Meyer. Or Mayor. He probably wants to take part in the coup. We don't need him. We can stop the coup ourselves. Yeah, Kazuki really hates his dad. He's got a hate boner. <laughs> Sorry. Kazuki. Why does it keep going to this? I think it's like maybe you want to check networking or whatever. I assume it's to take a quick break, but also to, so like you're just not exposition dumped, but uh, also to give you a chance to check mail, networking, or whatever. Um, a man named Lukov is here in Japan. Uh, tell me where he is. Lukov is uh, of the imaginary numbers. You know him? Yes, your parents told me about him. Oh, that information could be brought up so much earlier, Dad! <laughs> Estimation point. So you knew? You knew that a list is an imaginary number? Well, I don't think that was the thing. I mean, yeah, so it's important, but I'm talking about the Lukov thing. Dad, did you conduct research on Alyssa? I knew about imaginary numbers. So what? I talked to my friend's beloved daughter. Who cares about imaginary numbers? Dad. Alyssa, my friends loved their daughters. Even if they weren't truly related, they were a real family. A real family? Not my dad. That's why they risk their lives to protect you. Tut tut tut. You didn't feel their love? I didn't feel their love because they didn't give it back to me. Thanks, Dad. I know that you and Kazuki both love me. We're a real family. Yep, a real family. Yes, you're my only daughter. <laughs> only daughter. I, you have a son. My only daughter. <laughs> Wait, you know Lukov is a dangerous guy? Then why do you leave him alone? So Sasuke has planned to mass produce Minus with Lukov's assistance. You can't risk a false move while they're working together. Lukov is after Midas. He's gonna steal Midas if we leave him alone. Fighting Lukov means fighting the coup forces. I can't start a civil war in Japan. Yeah, that wouldn't, uh, oh, we can go out if we want to. We can go out and get drunk. We can't turn Japan into a battlefield. Mizuki, please don't blame Colonel Takamura. He is in a difficult to position. Hmm. It's hard to, hard to make the call to go to war, send people out to die, and all that fun stuff. I've had enough. Let's go. Kazuki, wait! It's because Kazuki's so high headed. Colonel Takamura? I know they're right. But the problem is not so simple. Dot, dot, dot. You military people are so complicated. I told you to wait. Now give me a break. I'm running short on time. A colonel, only two positions can result from a war. A winner and a loser. You'd want a war here. It's good for business. Are you suggesting that we're going to start a war? <laughs> you got me all wrong. The war started when Sasuke joined forces with Lukov. What matters now is how this war will end. You can't wait. You can wait here to lose the war, or fight until you win. Dot dot dot. Isn't it time for you to make a decision, Colonel? You're fighting a losing war with your son already. You have a big mouth for a mercenary. Well, I can say whatever I want because I'm a mercenary. <laughs> well, I, I, you know, it's not. It's not. Uh, what's it? It's not being boisterous if it if it's true or something like that, or if you can back it up. Tadayuki, or Tadayuki. Miho, sorry about this. Seriously, you had me worried. You're one to talk. You quit the military intelligence, became became a police officer, and then disappeared. I'm sorry. I know Major Karoi was your supervisor. Were you working for him? No. Oh. Yes, I was under his orders to watch Kazuki's robe. I see. But why? Why did you take part in a coup? Ah, oh, so, I mean, I mean, she's still helping us now, but you know what I mean, so. Let me check something really quick. Sometimes when it, I've noticed that, like, sometimes if it breaks like that, sometimes, like, mail is sent or something like that. I mean, other than, obviously, to, uh, break up the, uh, all the conversation or whatever. I'm just kind of saying, uh, I won't do this right here. I'll just do, like, what I do before and just check mail at the end of a... Nope, nothing there. Okay. 
Just making sure. I mean, I could probably look up or, or point out, like, every single time, like, an actual male appears in the game, but, uh... Yeah, I'd rather r try to remember or figure it out on my own, that type of thing. Okay, anyway, let's keep talking. Do you remember my brother? He was a good commander. We lost a great man. He was sent overseas as a backup squad to the OCU military. His death was announced as an honorable death in battle. What about it? Yeah, what about it? The government sent him to front prohibiting any battle. I learned about it when I joined the intelligence. Or joined the intelligence. What? He was the government's pawn in gaining influence of their OCU. I began thinking after I learned the truth behind his death. Dot dot dot. Why do I have to protect the country that killed my brother? Am I fighting for the right cause? I became confused. Then a man said to me, um, The military sh that should be protecting the citizens is now a tool for politics. Well, you really threw your voice, Mio. They'll crush Japan. We must change this country before that happens. The Japan we must protect is not... Er, the Japan we must protect is not this one. And that was Yuji Kuroi. But watching you and Kazuki made me understand. It's not the country or the government that needs protecting. It's the people. But I just can't change our country for the better. You're strong. Okay, who just says crap like that? Yes, but not as strong as I'd like. Yeah, you need to work out. Get some... Become a beefcake. Beefcake! <laughs> now, that'd be crazy seeing a, seeing a beefcake female bodybuilder's version of Miho. You know, I wouldn't be surprised if there's something like that on the internet somewhere. That, don't even talk about it. You're going with Kazuki's group, aren't you? Yes, I still have things to do. Like, get my hair done and get my nails looked at. No, I want to stay, but I'm sorry. Don't worry about me. Don't do anything rash. Of course not. <laughs> I like that look of her way she's looking over this thing and smiling. Miho, Miho, when this is all over... Exclamation point? Or exclamation point. Never mind, I'll tell you when this is all over. Sure. So were they were they a thing, or was it kind of the whole... They, they care about each other, but it never came that far, because it's like, oh, I don't know, awkward. Maybe he's a friend of her brother's or something like that. That type of thing. What's there to think about? Kazuki. Here we go again. Round and round in circles like a roundabout. Leave him alone, Alyssa. He'll calm down sooner or later. If he's a soldier, why doesn't he fight to protect the civilians? It's because he's a soldier. Miho. Is your boyfriend okay? Yes, thank you. Kazuki, your father doesn't want to see the Japanese people fight each other. No one wants to see that. He's trying to settle the situation without bloodshed. It doesn't matter. Lukov is moving to get Midas while we stall here. Your father knows. That's why he's in conflict. He drives me insane. I feel like I'm taking crazy pills. <laughs> Sorry. Can't you can't you settle down? And they repeat, okay, they just repeat each other. So, Kazuki, Dad isn't entirely wrong. Er, <laughs> Kazuki, Dad isn't entirely wrong. Think about his position. No, sorry about <laughs> breathing issues a little bit, so excuse me. Like father, like son, especially how stubborn you both are. Kazuki, please trust your father. Maybe you and your father should go to some family therapy. Well, that might be worth it. Your father cares about you. Be kind to him. I think Lance. I think Lance part of the story is pretty much done for. <laughs> like she joined us and did this all this thing, but yeah, I think she her characterization is pretty much done. I think almost with Liu, pretty much, except until we actually actively attack Luca for the most part. I have no interest in your family affairs. I noticed his mentality has also changed a lot too ever since we found out he was serving Lord Ball. It's like he's almost kind of not the same guy anymore, at least the way we see him. So. Because he's also been kind of pushed in the background, so, sort of. Not completely, but... I think we get a... Yeah, I think this new shop has a new upgrades and purchases, I think. Let me see. Uh, let's see, yeah, we can finally be, uh, buy the Kyo K108s again, after all this time. Because uh, you can only get it if you capture them at the, like, the very beginning of the game. Or, or like, well, I guess capture them, that's it. Um, I think in the previous... Uh, the Emma USN campaign, I think you could buy them at some point, but in this game, you can't buy them till like, now. 
Uh, Provs, I think you could still buy them on the website. Same with Kazels. Um, I, I think so. Maybe not the... No, I think, yeah, the Kazels and okay, I think you could buy them, but not the Provs, but... Yeah, uh, so, okay, no new parts. Uh, let's see, any new backpacks? Oh, we finally got the, uh, finally got the final backpacks in the game. The, uh, Capacity 8 and, uh, and, uh... The uh, 90 backpacks, so we'll uh, equip and sell all the. Oh, yeah, that's fine. Never mind. I don't need. I don't need the uh, unique backpacks anymore. Uh, let's see. The fist. So yeah, we've got all the. Oh, what? It's the same thing. What the heck, Gabe? The big. All the. All the big buster looks like it's just. It's just a different look, but it's the same. Same strength. Boo. Okay, fine. Eh, how about a new shotgun? No new shotguns? Really? Just, uh... Huh. Well, at least the... Uh, let's see. What's the heavy shield? Oh, no, no, no. He doesn't... Okay, never mind. He doesn't use the shield. But yeah, no new shotgun or anything. Huh. Eh, let's see. Items are the same. Um... Oh, no, we don't need that. And computers. Yeah, we've got high activation, low combo. Um... Ooh, acquire up. Finally got that one. That one where we can just... Um, so, activate is basically to... If you, have an, if you have a skill, you know, it activates. But it might not combo, like if you have the combo thing. But if you have high combo, they might not activate regularly. But when they do, they'll most likely combo. But if you're having trouble just getting skills to activate, we can now finally do that with this. I'll probably end up buying a couple off-screen for... So, like, maybe for Mayor and... Uh, um, uh, land because because of how like it's I tried doing off screen I tried doing some simulations to get some skills it was taking forever for and I still didn't get anything to pop up so um, let's see so I'm going to basically I'm going to well let me see if there's any um, upgrading to do and then after that I'll do all that off screen and then we'll come back after I've uh, yeah it looks like we've got HP level fives, uh, no new accuracy or defense. Yeah, it looks like it's HP upgrades. So, and I've got plenty of money. So yeah, I'll be back in just a second. I'm gonna upgrade everyone I can, and I'm probably gonna give Land and Mayor acquire percentage uh, computers so they'll have a easier time trying to activate, uh, actually get those skills so I can actually utilize them better. So I'll see you in a second. All right, we're back. I did all the upgrading and. Uh, and uh, actually, I didn't have to replace any weapons because all the weapons are just same power as the previous one. So only buy them if you didn't have them in the first place, basically. Although you could just go to the network shop and buy the other weapons anyway. So whatever. Um, I decided to buy a couple of the percentage acquired computers uh, for um, for when I do some simulation stuff. Maybe try to unlock that stuff off screen. So I decided to buy a few more than I expected. But... Uh, uh, because why not? It's basically the same as the computer six. You just have acquire percentage up, so why not buy a few extra ones? So, um, oh right, we need to go to the bar and get drunk. After talking with our dad, we just we just gotta drown out our sorrows. You know, cats in the cradle and all that stuff. So let's see how the regulars are doing. It was a coup in Tokyo area. It doesn't really matter. It's a sleepy country town like this. <laughs> That's why we don't have to worry about it. Now okay, it just repeats. I'm a regular girl. Somebody hit started a coup. They're fighting a war out there. There are people can't even go out. Oh, how apropos that is to current time. Well, a specific thing, but uh, I don't want to go any further to... I don't want to date this. I just can't believe there's a war going on. No one can ever tell that. Why is it called the Quiet Man, then, if he's talking... Anyway. There's fighting within the JDF because of the coup. Wasn't there any way to avoid the bloodshed? There never is. Ever. Why do you have to fight each other? Catch potato. There's nothing on TV. Only programs that air on uh, are news about the coup. Is it because that Tucker Murray guy started a coup? He started a coup coup. Coo 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 coo. I want to watch variety shows. And I want to watch good TV. Hey, you're all here. Rudolph, where have you been? Never mind. Looks like we won't have to fight you guys. We won't have to fight you guys. The, the deal is done. You mean he hired Wulong? We're all we're allies until the contract expires. Good, huh? We'll make lots of money. 
looks like your father made a decision. Da da da. I thought you don't fight wars you can't win. Don't you think the coup forces have the advantage? It's a matter of balance. They won't pay us as much. Besides, we don't like Ukov. We lost to him in Shanghai. It's payback time. You lost him? All right. You all have a big you all you all have a big ego for mercenaries. Not as big as yours. Oh damn, burn! No, I'm sorry. <laughs> we don't have time for small talk. Let's get back and start briefing. <laughs> That's what she said. We don't have much time. Don't be fooling around. We're only allies because of the contract. Don't talk to me. Good lord, lady. Is there anything we can, can we do? Can we give you a piece of cake? Can you take the cake and be fine with us, okay? You don't have to love us. Just have to just shake hands and say, how do you do? Ladies, we can fight together again. Be happy. Don't worry. I'll be happy. Oh, too bad. I wanted to fight you guys. I keep changing his voice. We don't need you guys. Just leave everything to us. Did I actually say anything extra? I didn't think I did. Yeah, it's kind of cool in the DHZ pathway. You kind of fight with the Wulong instead of fighting against them like you do on the USN campaign. I mean, not like they join the team or anything like that, but you know what I mean. Like I said, the two different campaigns are almost... Com I mean, there's the general overarching plot is the same for both campaigns, but I like how they're... They're, you know, like, the characters and everything you interact with are drastically different from each other. You know, unlike other games where if they have different paths, it's like the same thing, except for, like, one little difference or something like that. You know? Have you made a decision, Colonel Takamura? Looks like I'll have to face the enemy. I never thought a mercenary would make me realize that. And it's all about the money. Took you long enough to catch on. Jesus, the Kazuki, give the man a break. I'll let that one go for now. And the next time I'm going to beat your butt because I'm still your father. Shut up. <laughs> Stop it, Kazuki. Man, sometimes it's hard to root for Kazuki sometimes as a hero, you know, as the main character. Do you have a specific plan, Colonel? Don't tell us we'll have to force our way through. <laughs> Don't tell us we'll have to punch it. We'll have to punch it really hard? I hate you, Kakarot. I'm tired of Kazuki's plan. Are you saying that's the only plan I ever come up with? Eh, pretty much. Yes. You are like Goku. She's right. Yep. You know. <laughs> you have anything to say, Taguchi? Takaguchi? The Colonel will explain the mission. Hmm. Listen up. The coup forces currently consist of divisions from Nir Nirima, S Sumigahara, Fukuoka, Naha, and Yokosuka. All these Japanese names, I can't pronounce them all properly. I'm not even pronouncing properly, period, but the, divi the divisions of Moriyama, Senzo, and Kumamoto were defeated. None of the divisions are maintained in neutral position. How many allies do we have? Kira base, divisions from Kaita, Kamicho, and Obihiro. Kaita base was destroyed. We're totally outnumbered! We're all gonna die! We're at a disadvantage because we started late. Our allies will be crushed like Kaida base if we don't get moving. Why don't you go out there and stand in front of the firing squad, dude? You save that. I think we should gather our forces in one place. She's right. Let's transport the OB Hero Division to Sendai using Curry's naval squad. We'll meet up in Fukushima and take the Sumigahara Division. Oh, sounds. Oh, sounds. I was going to talk to Takamachi. Yeah, whatever. Who's going to protect this base? The enemy can attack here while we're fighting in Fukushima. Moriyama's 10th Division will protect the base. Are you crazy? Moriyama is defeated by the enemy. Moriyama's command, Isagai, doesn't intend to join the coup. He volunteered to become hostage to avoid unnecessary bloodshed. Oh, I see. So once we rescue the commander, the 10th Division is free. Free, I tell you! He's being held in Nagoya. But we must send most of our forces to Fukushima. The rescue operation... Nagoya must be conducted by a small squad. Da 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 da! I wonder who has to go do that. Sounds like a job for us. Thanks, Mayor. Thanks for that, Ermeyer. Whatever. How about it, Kazuki? We'll do it. How about you? Are you ready? I heard some extra help. Leave it to the pros, little guy. <laughs> oh, God. Rudolph's, Rudolph is just such a jerk sometimes. Gather at the dock when you're ready. Alright. Well, I guess we're ready to move. 
I just told you to gather the dock. What are you, hard of hearing? Kazuki, if you have time, use this training data. It'll be a good warm-up. Uh, he gives us a new um, uh, simulation program. Uh, I forgot what it's called. Leave the rest to us. Well, I guess we should go. Um, oh, I guess go out if we want to go to... Um, uh, if we want to... Uh, yeah, go back to the shop or whatever else we want to do before before that. Make a save, all that fun jazz. So uh, I would definitely suggest doing that here before we go to the next section. You'll land on Nagoya by submarine. Takaguchi will explain the mission on route. Don't worry about us. You should worry about yourself. Ah, oh, you're worried about your dad. I'm not worried. Show me how good you really are in battle. Will do. Kazuki, we're leaving. Okay. Got it. Some one one to two syllable words. Got it. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> on to the on to the bell. Man, yeah. I really gotta find a good spot for uh networking and stuff like that. Cause I don't I should at least do it before we end the game, because although I guess I could mm, cause networking is more important to do well, I mean, you could completely skip it and be fine throughout the whole game. But networking is kind of important to do when the game tells you about it, because then you can, well, if you want to, look up about history, about the world, or what's going on, or other places and stuff like that. So if you do it at the end of the game, I mean, you found, yeah, whatever. Looks like Takamura is on the move. He'll probably merge with the 5th Division of Obahiro. Should we attack before they merge? But do what you want. Watch out for Takamura's mercenaries. Ugo have had trouble with them in the DDG. Chief of Staff, I don't think Glukov is trustworthy. But we can't finish Midas without him. Don't worry, all we need to do is his, uh, need is his knowledge of Midas. Once Midas goes from mass protection, he'll be taken care of. <laughs> do we really need to mass produce Midas? Midas is a great weapon, but I believe it should never be used. Major, don't talk back to me! You keep quiet and follow my orders! I'm sorry, sir. This is a chance for Japan to lead the world. We can't give up now. Hmm. And another case of one. He's not really one to rule the world, but he wants to be, you know, a heavy power in the world. Kazuki, you're approaching the Sea Base. Roger that. Mr. Takaguchi, what's the situation in Nagoya? Commander Isagai is being held in the chemical factory. Right in the middle of the city. Great. Are we going through the city? That would cause civilian casualties. Yes, let's avoid any battles and surprise the enemy. What are we going to do? Uh, take a look at this. This map I have right here, stuffed in my pants. I had this up my... Oh, never mind. <laughs> so say some the crew there. What's that? It's the Nagoya Underground Sewage Treatment Plant. This is the chemical factory for where they're keeping the commander. Passing through the plant puts you directly under the chemical factory. Hmm. Where all the sewage comes down. Great. So we're going under the city. Ew. Smells gross. Well, you gotta, gotta do some bad things if you want to survive, I guess. We're going through the sewer? No way! I'd rather die than go through a sewer. No, they're pretty smelly. I've had to... Well, let's just... Never mind, I won't talk about that. The, the van will stay here. Wait a minute. Well, then it's either go in the sewer or stay here like a good little girl. Well, if you don't want to go... That doesn't mean I want to stay here. Um, you'll be in a bonzer. You won't smell anything. But my bonzer will get dirty. It's a bonzer. It's like a vehicle. It's gonna get dirty. Well, then maybe you should stay behind. <laughs> Even me host t uh, 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 messing with her. Dot, dot, dot. Come on, fam. You gotta do it. Kazuki, can't I go above ground? No. Quit complaining or we'll leave you behind. You marmy tart. All right, fine. You're all going to help me clean my fonts or when we get back. No, we won't. Go get your butler to do it. He wants to, he wants to do it, even though he's getting paid for it. Because he loves taking care of his master. Whatever Pierre is doing right now. I guess he's helping the Louis family right now while, while she's off gallivanting. 
I kind of wish Pierre came with us just so we could always get an extra dude every time we chose fam. Although that would... I'm kind of glad they got rid of it because then it would kind of put high priority over one character over another. Which, I think the point of this game is to build, like, have different builds of characters when you get your full party and then you can kind of swap out depending on your build. Although the bad thing is that they can... Oh, wow, you hardly ever see this look from her. Maybe it was a bad idea. Like her pain expression or whatever. What are you babbling about? You just don't know when to give up. Hey, I'll complain if I want to. Just make out already. No, I'm just kidding. Shh. <laughs> Even though Kazuki's the high head, sometimes he has to be the one in control. But yeah, like... I mean, there is some difference between the characters, obviously, with the, the different classes of characters, but... I mean, technically you could just... Oh, I'm sorry, I don't think we can... Skip. Sorry, I wasn't even reading his dialogue, so I didn't I didn't expect to just go on without me pressing anything, so sorry about that. Or I think it's maybe said something about I don't think we can get out of fight on this or something. Maybe it might be better to go back and go from above? You're going to have to go through the sewer, fam. No, we'll have to force our way through. We can't let them call for backup. We should hit them hard. Hey, Glenn got some lines. Did you hear that? Give it up. Fine. Then let's give it to them real good. Hey, who's that? Or is that just some random dude? Sergeant, we're getting attacked by monsters. Enemies! Yes, I see that. They're trying to get to the chemical factory. They aren't that, there aren't that many. Let's go get them. <laughs> get them, Ray. Good plan. Now so much for getting in un uh, uh, surprised. Oh well. At least it's not the whole army and there's no civilians here, so that should be easy. Or, well, not easy, but should be um, reasonable. So, all right. Um, yeah, this one's uh, this one's pretty much pierce, uh, piercing all the way. After that, it really comes down to, like, um, uh, who you just want to... At this point in the game, it, until, like, certain missions, pretty much just play choose whoever you want to play as, so... You know, if you want to play as the new characters, great. If you want to keep uh, working on your old team, do that as well. I kind of like uh, using new characters to try and get their skills activated and stuff like that. So, uh, and to get their AP up. I did a little AP grinding, not too much. It doesn't actually take that much to get AP levels in simulation. You just swap out their weapons with something that they don't normally use to keep their weapon levels down, and boom, there you go. So, um, let's see, D rank. Kazuki could use some levels in his uh, weapons. Let's see. C. Um, yeah, Liu badly needs his uh, weapon levels to get up, go up. But I don't know. Sniper sniper rifles or, or weapons like that team to, for weirdly just seem to get the shaft in this game. Even though there's skills and ability to help with that. I don't know. Just even missiles that are one shot seem to have a bit more of a bit more use than the, I mean I'm not saying they don't have use I don't know I just every time I use a, a, a sniper user it just they just never work out as well as some of the other classes you know I don't know maybe it's just maybe it's just the way I've been playing them um yeah uh, yeah we'll use Liu and I think yeah we'll use Kazuki just because I need to get his weapon levels up his pilot level is really high but his weapon levels are so low for whatever reason okay um, oh, it looks like we're on two different... Okay. So we'll hunt you there. Yeah, we'll just have Lan and Meyer work together. That just seems to be more prudent, I think. Uh, okay, so this map, we had to defeat six enemies within 30 attacks, 80 damage level average, weapon level 14. So with that 14... what? It, at some point, I need to actually show you what... Or tell you like the, what the actual weapon level I need is and not say 14. Uh, it's, I think it's like D three star or something like that. See, it's, what does it start at? It starts at like A, so it's A star, A two star. So A, 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 B, 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 C, C, C. So that makes up nine. So, uh, D, 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 that's, uh, that's 12. So, um, Whatever, I don't think it's D afterwards. I don't think, or I don't think it's E after D. I think it goes into S after that, but it's whatever the next letter is at a two star. 
So technically, we have a lot of levels we can unlock uh, to if you really wanted to grind for them. But anyway, um, and uh, one of the things about this one is that uh, this fight, let's see if we can find them, is the Shunyo, uh, Shunyo or whatever. Yeah, those are the mechs that uh, Kazuki and Ryogo used at the very beginning of the game before they got their official mechs, you know, before they got destroyed or whatever. So yeah, they may kind of make a comeback. Um, I forgot what the Shunyos, what their big thing is. Let me see. Um, let's see, Shunyos. Uh, they have body, their body has damage fixed 400, so it causes the damage to be reduced to 400, like if there was some big powerful shot, like a, like a laser, or, you know, whatever damage reduces it to 400. But it has to be within the 408 to 800 range to do that. Um, arms do revenge. Um, what that means is basically if if, a pon, a von, if an enemy Vonzer destroyed one part, you'll counterattack and destroy the exact same thing that got destroyed um, if you can do it. But you have to be attacked first, so you can't go, go first and have an activate, that type of thing. And then legs are not bad, actually. reduce uh, They have AP minus 60. So if you can... Uh, I don't, I don't remember if you can capture these or not. Uh, might be worth at least capturing one just to have the mech, but I'm not sure if you can buy them later or not. Maybe? But anyway, I'll try to capture one just for grins. Uh, we also got the MK5AFBs. They have, uh, I think, yeah, rifles, so cannons. That's why you, I think everyone has, yeah, I think everyone has piercing, so that's why you wanna, oh yeah, they have topple shot. Um, these guys have no battle skills. Uh, we've got some Inyos. They have Panic Shot, so that can be kind of annoying. Uh, but nothing that we can't handle. Especially if your AP levels are kind of high, then it shouldn't be shouldn't be too bad. But yeah, I might try to capture a Shunyo just to have it. The AP minus 60 would be pretty good, but I don't know if that's better than the Kazels, though. I'll have to, I'd have to look that up. Oop, uh, do we want to move that far? Let's see. I can't. I did move one more. All right, let's. Uh... Oh, nice. Yeah, with the with the. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I forgot. Uh, well, I mentioned I acquired. I, I purchased the the ac acquire pr up ability. Um, but uh, on a. Ooh, whoa, that's a well. Might as well equip it. But oh yeah, I forgot the smash abilities are really high high maintenance because, I mean, they can straight up and destroy a part if they activate. I mean, that's crazy, you know. So, hopefully we'll see a lot more skills activate at least. And then off screen, I'll probably end up in between recordings, probably end up um, uh, just skill acquiring off screen. I know you can only, um, depending on the computer you buy, you can only acquire so many of a skill before um, you can't learn it anymore. Although, be, yeah, be careful about the acquire computer because sometimes one of the benefits of battle is having it pop up instead of activating via a skill or whatever, or via, you know, having it and activating. It's a way to have an, uh, an acquire up is a way for you to get combos from stuff you don't normally have equipped. You know, so kind of keep that in mind as well. Um, did that guy move? Yeah, he did. And I, and, oh, and I, as far as I'm aware of, um, the ability doesn't unlock, or you don't, it doesn't unlock if you... Oh, Salvo activated. Yes, I love this ability. Too, well, of course, the only problem is that, you know, it uses all your ammo, so you have to use a turn afterwards to, uh... uh so, yeah, if you can, if you can have a... Um, nice. If you can have a good high backpack, you know, with, a, with this person... The only problem is that the weight... Of, of having like the salvo arm and everything like that can uh, um, deter uh, make it hard for you to bi have a build where you get the high the high backpack with uh, with eight holds or whatever. I'll to I'll to modify Alyssa and uh, um, after acquiring all the skills I want, I'll to modify their builds to give them an eight point backpack, which will allow me to equip four missile slots. So that means salvo could pretty much be used in the whole battle pretty easily, so. Alright, well, anyway. Um, probably just want to do a, oh, anti-fire. Boo! Alright, fine. Um, well, you can't counter, so there's that, at least. Yeah, it's open one of those that we got today. Oh, well. Alright, uh -huh. 
party you have to be in. Come on, zoom. Yes. Oh, well, you still hit him. Maybe I should give him high activation. Because he has plenty of zooms. But that wouldn't that wouldn't necessarily give him combos, though. Mm. Oh, well. Oh, nice. Oh, well, he won't be able to hit us with his shoulder weapon or whatever, but still. Not too bad. The fight's going pretty, pretty relatively easily. It's not a difficult fight, by the way. Um... Yeah, I'm trying to give. I'm trying to raise Kazuki's fist ability. Oh, that'll. Oh yeah. Oh, nice double assault. Heck yeah. Boom. You got wrecked, son. Nice. Yeah, for being an assaulter, weirdly enough, Kazuki's fist level tends to. Every time I always played it, I always had trouble getting Kazuki's. Um, uh, melee skill high because I always ended up using the shotgun quite a bit more often even though he does even though he's a striker character you know all right let's get her closer since I have to use a turn for missiles anyway so oh uh, yeah salvo salvo is probably my favorite of the uh, um, what's this one here right salvo is probably my favorite of the uh, um, skills at least for missilers anyway um, He'll counter though, so. Would have loved that stuff to activate, but whatever. No, he's anti impact, so I'll just punch him. Aw, oh, man. I was hoping you'd, uh. You would have to, or activate double fist assault or whatever. Fist assault! I need her to get more AP because I always want to use like you know 11 hit, but you know I want her to have at least enough uh, to use shield, you know. And of course, even though with the new high acquire or high chance of acquire, she's still not activate any of her abilities. I want rate of fire to unlock on her. That's the whole point of equipping that one arm. But oh well. It's weird how that one isn't that one uh, isn't doing anything. Oh yeah, I have plenty of I have plenty of AP. Now, yeah, Kazuki's uh because I'm still using the Zenithlev head, he, he his damage uh, core reduction is very low. It's only 50. percent But I talked about that before. How high HP level um, characters tend to uh, or high HP parts tend to um, have poor defense mods because that's the you know, it's all about guessing, you know. If I move one more, I can get, possibly get the thing, so I'll have you move up. Uh, either one, really. Oh, well, like, minus AP, I guess. That's something. So it's gonna be zoom. Dang it, Liu! Give me a reason to put you back in the group. Way on that thing. Aw oh, man, I was hoping Salvo would activate. Oh well. Yeah, he should be. Shouldn't he be like coming after us and attacking us? But eh, whatever. All right, time to get an AP 11 out of the way. Oh nice. That's really helpful, actually. That's the point I gave her the legs, so so she'll have enough AP. Well, actually, never mind. She doesn't have her shield anymore. But normally. Having AP minus 30 would be awesome. You know. uh, probably better just shotgun that guy. There we go. And I'll just punch him later on with the... Oh, wait, no. That's going to be kind of annoying. Oh, now he finally moves. Now I guess he's going to attack... Oh, I thought he was going to attack land there for a second. Huh. Not bad, not bad. Oh, that's right. She didn't have any AP. Because I moved her all the way. I didn't think she was going to get attacked. Oh. Nuts. Well, that stinks. Hopefully that doesn't raise my uh, 
weapon damage all that high. Ugh. Oh, wait, um. Zoom, zoom. Ah, fuck. There we go. Mainly because I don't want to miss. There we go. Finally getting you to activate zoom and all that. Sweet! Man, sometimes when I get lucky, I get lucky. Sometimes when I get bad luck, I get bad luck. Everything but the head! What is up with this game and not, like, getting headshots, you know? There we go. Took you five hits, but you did it, son. All right, you. Although if I back you up, you won't be able to. Uh, I could just do. Well, no, she might kill me even with the low. Because four, and she'll hit for sure. And it does 78 per hit. Yeah, I'll definitely kill him. Um, I mean, because if I don't do this, then we won't be able to get past them. So. You. Oh, he has anti hooks. Would, uh. She's gonna be hurt either way. Uh. Yeah, I'll punch, yeah, we'll punch him. It's gonna hurt, but. Nice tackle. Ugh. Oh, come on. No comboing or anything? Fine. Yep, I've got shield. I'm good to go. Whew. How many turns? Seven. I think we're... I think we're... What turn are we on now? Six? Yeah, okay. We should be able to do this. Oh yeah, I didn't even get to... What, what was the mech I captured? Oh, I got... Okay, I did capture a you. I didn't want to capture multiple ones, but I wanted to, I wanted to try and capture it. And... Should I get some... Maybe Salvo? No, alright, fine. I got lucky that one time, but I, can't, I guess I can't get lucky all the time. Should I just go... I shouldn't do this, but I'm going to, uh... Why is, there, why is this hurt to hit so low? Hmm. It should be higher. Oh, well. Yeah, I'll have to off-screen try to see if I can get her to activate Rate of Fire. So I can actually, um... better to shotgun. Well, either way. I just don't want to get hit. Well, you know. Ow. Well, there goes my shotgun arm, I guess. What are you doing? What's wrong with you? Fine. I've taken quite a bit of damage. I, I hope my weapon level, uh, weapon damage isn't too high. Get that, uh... Oh, he surrendered. Okay. Might as well try to see if I can get her to activate any of her, uh, skills. No. Why does she not want to acquire any skills? She has Rate of Fire and all this other stuff. The only one that activated was AP minus 30. And of course, now that we got the Shunyun legs, I'll have to see if those are any good. I might leave the Kazel legs on, because if I remember correctly, the Kazel legs are pretty good movement and HP. Um, okay, so I I just did too many attacks, but okay. Wow, I hit actually the exact damage average. Huh. I need to sell some of those Shun wings now that I think about it. I have plenty of parts. I might I might break down one one more of them and then uh, and then sell the rest of them. 
Nice job, everyone. Does the enemy's primary unit know? I don't know, but it's only a matter of time. Don't tell me we're going back after we come this far! God, the shrillness. Do you want me to call it? No, no, no. I was going to say a joke, but never mind. What's with the sudden rush of enthusiasm? Because I don't care anymore! I'm up for anything! Well, good, I guess? Should we calm her down? I think it's better that her not being enthused at all. One of the few times Kazuki smiles. We're, con we're continuing with the mission, then. Yep. And where's everyone else in the group? Yeah. <laughs> I mean, they're there, but they're just not interacting, so... It's probably too many, too many units on screen. It'd probably slow down the thing, but... Uh, well, we're on our journey to, uh, to save uh, an important man to help us with our mission. Will we be able to get to him in time, or does the enemy have another devious plot out their scheme? Find out next time in the next episode of Front Mission 3. Thanks for watching, hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you next time.